what's going on everyone and welcome back to the channel as we know since uh, 2013 we are living in an rgb world if you used to watch my channel you saw i have already reviewed several rgb products one of the brands i reviewed is cool moon which is a chinese company producing a vast variety of rgb products today we're gonna look at this argb 5 volt led magnetic bar as alternative to the standard led strips Let's start immediately with a quick unboxing as usual, so we're gonna look at what you get. Alright, let's see what we got here. You can see the product comes in a small box. We can read here on the right that we are talking about the 5 volt version, so addressable ARGB. As usual, make sure your motherboard has a proper support for it. At the back of the box, we can read the dimensions and we see we have 18 LEDs. As we will see later in the review, these are also high brightness LEDs. The cable is not too long, unfortunately, it's just 500 millimeters. And should be anyway fine when installing it in the case. First thing we notice when we open the box is the double-sided magnet which was applied to the bar. This will give us more freedom as we will see during the installation process in our case. The other two sides are made of acrylic material in order to help the LED light diffusion. And then we have two plastic cans in order to keep everything well protected. We proceed by removing the plastic film. Talking about the connectors, we see the cool thing here about Coolmoon. So the good thing is that they provided not only the standard 5 volt LED connector that we work with any motherboard brand basically, which will be obviously support 5 volt LEDs. We can see you get both the male and the female connectors. But anyway, Coolmoon, as we can see, also provides the small 4 pin interface plug that can be used if you have the Coolmoon controller. As usual, I prefer not to have any controller and like to keep everything clean connecting everything to the motherboard and then managing all the lighting effects through the motherboard RGB lighting software. But it's nice anyway to see that at least you have an option here for using the bar either with a standard 5 volt connector or maybe using their own controller that you can see right here. The magnets are quite powerful and it's a great feature in my opinion compared to the standard adhesive tape we find in most LED strips. With the magnets instead you can install and uninstall the bar, move it around very easily as many times as you like. I'll be plugging the Coolmoon bar into my 1-2-10 ARGB splitter. Since my ASUS Stuff X570 only has one ARGB connector. Once we turn on our PC, we see how well these 18 LEDs are working. Also, the diffusion is really good and provides a stylish look. The double magnet will give us more flexibility for the installation, so you can better decide the direction of your light. You can see I tried securing it here on the top of my case, but the light can be a bit annoying after a while, as it will be mostly direct into my face. I went for installation on the front side of my case. The Coolmoon bar is basically attached to the case on the one side and to the front radiator on the other side. 
as we see the result is really good and the lighting effects of the bar are obviously synced with all my other devices such as the fans, the RAM, the motherboard, CPU water bowl, SSD cover and even the water cooling pump. Now you can see how I switch among the different modes in the ASUS Aura software. In this last demo we show you a custom lighting effects I programmed with the Ososora software. So if you want to add some kind of ARGB lighting into your system, these cool moon LED bars can be a really great optional alternative to the standard LED strips. The light diffusion in these things is so much better, it's much more elegant and cool in my opinion, and the magnets make the installation extremely easy, rather than the usual tape you find. But you should also consider the thickness, in fact these ARGB bars are obviously much thicker than usual LED strips. Also pay attention to the dimensions. I could only find this uh, 30 cm version and the 28 cm version. So if you need something longer than that, obviously the LED strips will be a better option as you can get those in sizes of one meter or more. And as usual, you get more FPS, right? Since more RGB means more FPS. <laughs> Alright guys, that's all for this video, please leave a like if this video was helpful for you, also subscribe to the channel for supporting me, it would be much appreciated. If you like, you can also have a look to the other videos in my channel, there might be something interesting to you. Thanks for watching everyone, and we'll see you in the next video.